Engineers at Fukushima Daiichi in northeastern Japan have been trying to locate melted nuclear fuel inside a damaged reactor. They sent in a robotic camera last week, which they had to abandon after it got stuck. But it was able to send back helpful data, the first ever pictures of the interior of the containment vessel. Tokyo Electric Power Company engineers inserted the remote controlled robot into the number one reactor through a pipe. The snake like machine is designed to navigate around obstacles. It got stuck after moving a little more than 10 meters, but not before capturing important footage. Debris and machine parts are on its path. The temperature is reading at 20 degrees, and steam can be seen rising. Experts say water at the bottom of the vessel is evaporating due to the heat generated by the melted nuclear fuel. The radiation level is reaching 10 sieverts per hour in some places. The dose is deadly after 40 minutes of exposure. At one point, the reading shoots above 20 sieverts. TEPCO says they will analyze the footage to try to find ways to remove the molten fuel. The reactor melted down following an earthquake and tsunami four years ago. Japanese leaders are hammering out a compromise to cut the country's greenhouse gases by the year 2030. They're targeting a reduction of 20 to 30 percent. The new plan comes as leaders disagree on how much to cut. Environment Ministry officials want a 30 percent decrease, but officials with the Ministry of Industry say that's too high. They want a reduction of 15 percent instead. They say a higher number will put too much pressure on industry. They're trying to negotiate a compromise of 20 percent or more. Observers say it will require more power from renewable energy sources and nuclear plants. But officials say renewables could lead to higher costs, and there has been strong opposition to nuclear power. Officials from Japan and other countries must submit their targets to the UN before a year-end conference. The United States and all European Union members have already turned in their plans. The EU goal calls for at least a 40 percent cut by 2030. Ischemia. 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 Local deficiency of blood supply produced by vasoconstriction are local obstacles to the arterial flow.